So we have vectors and we're gonna perform some operations on vectors. So here I will discuss the arithmetic operations that we allow for, uh, for working with vectors. So the question is what can we do with vectors? Well the first thing that we would allow for is addition. So if we have two vectors of the same length, so we have a vector u with coordinates u1 to un, and we have another one v, being the vector with coordinates v1, v2, etc. to vn, then we will speak of the sum of u and v, u plus v. This is the vector where we add the vectors component-wise, so we add the corresponding components, so u1 plus v1, u2 plus v2, etc. till the nth coordinate equals un plus vn. The alternative terminology is that we speak of v1, v2, etc., vn. They are also called components instead of coordinates or entries of v and rn. Well, the second operation that we will allow for is scalar multiplication. So if we have a vector, then we may speak of So the second, multi second ma ma manipulation of vectors that we will allow for a scalar multiplication. So what does it mean? Well, if we have a vector x, then we can speak of two times the vector x. Well, in general, for general constants c in r and the vector in rn, u, we define c times u as the vector with c times the co first component, c times the second component, until c times the nth component. And the C is called a scalar. So for example, we may now subtract vectors from each other. U minus V is by definition U plus minus 1 times V. So we have a sum and we have a scalar multiplication by minus 1. So something that is important is that we will not define a division by vector. So we only may add vectors and multiply it by a constant. But not what we do not do is divide a vector by another one. 